Hey guys, it is Scott the Steen Roller Steen with winnersandwiners.com coming to you with the one and only Steen Roller free play of the day. As always, if you're having a little fun, maybe even making a buck or two, we'd appreciate it if you give us a thumbs up for the video. Give everybody a chance here before we get too buried in football stats and whatnot. So at the count of three, everybody smash that thumb if you'd be so kind. Three, two, one, smash it, smash that thumb, smash. Oh man, you guys. You guys are on it today. Well done, each and every one of you. Appreciate it. Uh, of course, if you haven't done so already, hey, think about subscribing to the YouTube channel. Uh, that way you get notified each and every time we put up brand new content, my daily stuff, Scott's daily stuff, and the videos that we do each and every day called Today in Sports Betting. So, uh, as always, we want to know what you're playing. Give us your best picks. Put them in the comment section. You get them right. You uh, will get the shout out. And if you get enough of them right, you will be the capper of the day. And if you need any help with your stats or uh, finding out more opinions on the games, don't forget to check out winnersandwiners.com. Deep dives into every game every single day. If you can bet on it, you can bet they're writing about it at winnersandwiners.com. All right, guys, a quick recap of yesterday's action. You know what? It was a weird game. Uh, that really was. Uh, the Ravens actually outgained them. Buffalo had no running game, as I predicted. And you know what? Didn't matter. Didn't matter um, as the uh, uh, the Buffalo uh, the Buffalo defense did just enough. Uh, the, uh, the of course obviously the, the uh, interception in the end zone return for 101 yards was the absolute backbreaker as the, the Ravens were trying to tie the game there in the third quarter. Uh, reminded me of the uh, of the Pittsburgh return in the Super Bowl against Arizona a few years back, where that just totally changed the tenor of the game, and the Pittsburgh Steelers of course went on to win, and that's what happened tonight. Um, just to, just the Ravens could not put it together at the right time, and they went down to victory. Of course, in the opener, the Packers did their thing. Uh, we did have the Packers on the premium side, minus 6.5, and, and we had the under in the late game because of the, the wind there uh, coming off of Lake Erie. So uh, premium side, good. Uh, free side, uh, yeah, Ravens let us down. So let's take a look and see what we got today. Uh, obviously, I've got my Chiefs jersey on. So you know what I'm going to bet, don't you? You ready? It's going to be the Saints. Uh, the uh, I've I've got uh, one of our one of our favorite plays. I've got the Saints on the uh, big little here. I've got them with a little win. The Saints win the game by one to thirteen points at plus one fifty. Hey guys, how many times you heard this this week? You can't beat the same team three times in the same season. That's hard to do. Uh, you know what? It's not. Uh, here's the deal. Since two thousand two. When the playoffs went to their current format, uh, teams looking to avoid an 0-3 sweep, they're just 2-5 and straight up in that third matchup. Saints have done it before. They beat Carolina uh, three times back in 2018. Uh, here's the other one you hear. Tom Brady's never uh, lost to the same team three times in the season. Guess what, kids? Before this year, never lost the same team two times in the season. You want to know who did it? Any ideas? Any guesses? Yeah, it was the Saints. So, you know what? They say in the outlaw Josie wheels, that means a doodly squat to me right there. Uh, what does matter to me is the fact that Ronald Jones is going to either be out or severely limited. That makes your starter uh, Leonard Fournette. Yeah, good good deal. Uh, Leonard Fournette has yet to average five yards in any game. In fact, he's averaged four yards just once. Uh, that was the last game against Washington. Uh, the good news for the Saints, uh, defensive end Trey Hendrickson is a full go. Uh, back from his injury, and he has dominated Tampa Bay in both games this season. Guys, I think the Saints get it done here. Tampa Bay, Tom Brady, I don't think they're going to get blown out. They're a good, solid team, but the Saints are going to do enough to get the victory here. Give me the Saints by 1 to 13 points, plus 150 at the end of that one. You guys can join me as we pick up our winning tickets and head back to the window. All right, everybody, you know how I did. Let's take a look and see. How y'all did today? Uh, Vegas J went 2 2 and 1. He got juiced. Darwin Tanko, 3 2 and 1, plus 90. Nice job, Darwin. Ninja 13. Uh, he was all kinds of all over the uh, uh, Buffalo Bills. By the way, most of you guys faded my Baltimore pick. Congratulations. Well done. Most of you are on the Bills. Uh, almost everybody was on the Packers. Few few stragglers here on the Rams. But uh, yeah, Ninja goes 2 and 0, oh, plus 200. Pat Cogney, he goes 1 and 1. He got juiced. Scott Ellis goes two and one plus ninety. Joshua Keys had a fine day five and one plus three ninety. Cast Films perfect slate two and zero oh, plus two hundred. Sandman 
Uh, he's in the middle of uh, three plays. He's in his first two so far. He's 2-0 and plus 200, and he has the Cleveland Browns plus 10 today. Sewer boy goes 3-3. Three and three. He got juiced. Jones hit a little, uh, hit a little uh, UFC parlay, a little MMA parlay there from Fight Island. Nice job, Joe. One and one, plus 125. The astute Aardvark goes two and one, plus 90. Eric Catherine clean sheet again, two and zero, plus 200. Hammer and Hank had one play and he made it big. It was on the Packers. Loved it, Hank. One and zero, plus 100. Super Sly, 32. He went two and two. He got juiced. And Mike S. put a note in, and I don't have times on this, Mike. I don't know when the particulars are, but he said that he hit 5 of 6, and then he hit 8 of 8. I don't care when you did it. Congratulations, sir. That's braggable right there, and you deserve your shout-out. But today, kids, your capper of the day, it's Joshua Keys going 5 and 1 plus 390. Hey, Joshua, nice job, my friend. You are the capper of the day. Congratulations, Joshua. Congratulations to the rest of you that made money. Hey, guys, it's Sunday. It's the last NFL game uh, uh, it's with the uh, with the two different. Uh, well, I guess we'll have two games next Sunday, so never mind. Uh, but yeah, we got uh, we got two games today, so let's say uh, go out there, have some fun, make a little money, and uh, you know what? We'll just meet back here tomorrow. And we'll talk all about. It. All right, you guys, take care. Have a great day. Thanks for watching. One more time, like and subscribe if you would be so kind. We'll see you next time. Bye bye, everybody.